Hi, my name is Jim Rickards. I'm a former advisor to the Pentagon, the CIA, and the Department of Defense. In the next 37 seconds, you will be one of the most informed and powerful people in America. I'm about to expose how an idiotic decision by Joe Biden on February 24th, 2022, destroyed a sacred U.S. asset that's been protected with blood for 50 years. His mistake has grave implications for your own savings and retirement accounts. In fact, I now predict Biden's blunder just kicked off the biggest transfer of personal wealth in our country's history. Here's everything you need to know. On a clear February evening in 1974, I was called to the Nixon White House to attend a top secret meeting. That meeting led to something very few Americans know anything about, the doomsday deal. I'm talking about a handshake agreement between certain countries that guarantees the U.S. stays the world's number one economic and military power permanently. Simply put, the doomsday deal is the most powerful contract ever written. 50 years ago, when the Nixon administration unleashed this new deal on the world, it transformed the United States from a shrinking, failing economy into the most formidable military and economic power our planet has ever seen. Consider this. Since the deal was signed, the U.S. population has increased by 62 percent, but our economy is now 1,500 percent larger. Ask me the biggest reason for this massive explosion of wealth? The doomsday deal. How am I so sure? Because half a century ago, I was in the White House making it happen. And it's why, since 1974, every past president, Republican or Democrat, has held the doomsday deal as sacred. And I firmly believe they've defended it by any means necessary. In 2003, when U.S. Special Forces dragged Saddam Hussein out of a stinking Iraqi hole, it was to defend this deal. Eight years later, when a U.S. predator drone took out the convoy of Libyan dictator Muammar Gaddafi, and Gaddafi was then dragged into the street by rebel soldiers, sodomized with a bayonet and executed on the site, it was to defend this deal. That's how vital it is to our country's economy and security. And while I'll reveal its official government title in a moment, I call it the doomsday deal because it has a very dark side. You could even think of it as an economic doomsday device because what it gives, it can also destroy. I predict without the doomsday deal, the America you know won't exist anymore. And the most massive wealth transfer our country has ever known will begin. The US dollar will crater. The relative value of your savings and retirement accounts will be destroyed. We'll suffer from hyperinflation, the likes of which we've never seen. America's global standing and security will be diminished forever. And that's not just my prediction. Here's Monica Crowley, Trump's assistant secretary of the US Treasury, on what would happen if the doomsday deal was broken. It would be a complete implosion of the American economic system. You'd be looking at sky high inflation, just raging. If you think inflation is bad right now, just wait. But more importantly, we would lose our economic dominance and we would lose our superpower status. The doomsday deal is that important. Without it, we get demoted to a secondary nation, poorer, weaker, with widespread citizen unrest. But that might not be the worst of it. We could be vulnerable to something once unthinkable, a Chinese or Russian attack against Americans on American soil. That's why it's my duty to announce to every American patriot, I now believe early last year, through his own arrogance and incompetence, Joe Biden broke the doomsday deal. It is now an active failure and it can't be stopped. Biden's reckless act, which I'll show you in a moment, is already creating massive global fallout. Soon, much of the current value of your savings and retirement accounts will be erased. In fact, because of Biden's idiotic blunder, many Americans will experience severe financial hardship, but not you. Because most importantly of all, I'm also going to show you right now how to not only survive the coming crisis, but emerge stronger and wealthier on the other side. You're about to see how to protect your money, your family, and even potentially vastly increase your own personal wealth. By taking advantage of certain specific opportunities, Biden's idiotic blunder has now opened up. Let me repeat that because it's important. If you know exactly what to do, you can potentially take advantage of certain profit scenarios being created by the death of the doomsday deal for a massive upgrade to your family security by acquiring extraordinary wealth from the crisis. Here's a fact the world's elite used to build their fortunes. In times of crisis, money moves. While most Americans will suffer greatly from Biden's failure, a smart few will have a chance to profit and profit big. Do you want to be one of them? Keep watching. But before I show you how this crisis is unfolding and how you still have a chance to exploit Biden's terrible mistake to protect your money and your family, I want to acknowledge this is a lot to take in. If you're skeptical, I respect that. 
But by listening this far, I can tell you, you're a lot smarter than most. You can't rely on the media to expose the truth about Biden's incompetence. And I believe you have a God-given right to view the disturbing evidence yourself, so you can make up your own mind. And please share this warning with your most trusted friends and family. They'll be so grateful. No one else is coming to save you from the crisis Biden has brought upon our country. You must act while you still have time. This is Fort Sumter on April 12, 1861, when the first shots of the Civil War were fired. The war has begun, even if most Americans won't realize it until it's much too late. And that brings me to exactly why I sent you this video today. I know firsthand the carnage this doomsday device is about to bring to our country. No one else understands the coming storm as I do. They weren't in the room when it happened, but I was. This gives me a unique insight into how this is going to play out. My evidence proves Calamity Joe Biden is not just the worst, but also the most dangerous president in modern history. Biden is desperate no one finds out about this mistake before the election, but I have all the information. You're about to hear private predictions available to very few Americans. You'll see exactly what the doomsday contract says. You'll see how it guaranteed our country would become the richest empire the world has ever seen. And you'll see how on February 24th, 2022, as part of his inept and clueless response to Russia invading Ukraine, blundering Joe Biden broke the contract, sending America to its doom. It can't be stopped because of Biden's idiotic act. The biggest wealth transfer in world history is now happening in real time, but it's taking place behind a veil of technical jargon, state secrecy, and hidden agendas. This makes it difficult for everyday Americans to see it. However, for those who recognize this wealth transfer and use it to their advantage by getting in on specific opportunities it will create, could stand to make enormous gains. In fact, if you know exactly what to do, you could potentially get in on this wealth transfer to secure massive unchecked wealth. That's what you're going to see right now. I'm going to show you how you can protect your hard earned money. But more than that, I know how to take advantage of certain opportunities created right now by this unprecedented crisis to create new financial security for some smart Americans. I refuse to let the elites benefit while good Americans suffer. And I'm going to show you everything starting right now. First, you should know who it is that's swinging this ax. My name again is Jim Rickards. And as I mentioned earlier, I've been an advisor to the Pentagon, the White House, the CIA, and the Department of Defense. I'm also an attorney, investment banker, and author of eight books on currencies and international economics. When places like Fox, CNBC, or Bloomberg want to know what's about to shake the global economy, they call me. I have one master's degree in international economics and another in taxation. I got my law degree from the University of Pennsylvania Law School. I worked at the highest levels of Wall Street and international finance for 40 years. I held senior positions at Citibank, Caxton Associates, and the hedge fund Long-Term Capital Management. I helped negotiate the end of the Iranian crisis for the Reagan administration. I've attended strategic sessions in the vaults, the secure meeting rooms inside the Pentagon. Here's a photo of me there. This is all I'm allowed to show you of the inside. In fact, I hosted the first ever financial war games for the Pentagon. I've been asked to the CIA director's secure conference room on the seventh floor of Langley headquarters. I've been inside the US Treasury and spoken privately with Treasury Secretary Tim Geithner. I've been invited into the Federal Reserve and had conversations with Ben Bernanke. Here's a snapshot of our discussion. I'll admit, I don't like talking about myself. I've never sought fame or attention. But I want you to know I'm not a pundit or media personality. I've walked the walk for more than five decades now, and the predictions you're about to see are based on my personal experience, research, and contacts in the intelligence community. Because most of all, like you, I'm a proud American patriot. By watching this presentation, you've already shown me that you are too. And you're a lot savvier than most. What you're about to see won't be easy to stomach. Calamity Joe Biden's mistakes set the wheels in motion. America's economic downfall is underway. The first signs are already here. You can watch it happen and suffer you like your neighbors, or you can protect yourself and even potentially generate life-changing wealth. For you and your loved ones, imagine being like Hugo Stinnes. Stinnes was a German who in the 1920s became one of the richest men in the world. While the rest of Germany was devastated by the Weimar hyperinflation, when consumer prices were doubling every four days and absolutely destroyed the German middle class, Hugo Stinnes took advantage of certain opportunities created by the crisis and made himself into the richest man in Germany. Similar opportunities will soon be available here. Do you want in? I'll show you everything you need to know here today. Now, if profiting while others suffer makes you uncomfortable, I understand. Then maybe this presentation isn't for you. 
But there's one thing you need to know. America is on the leading edge of an economic crisis like we haven't seen since the Great Depression of the 1920s. The time to act is now. And I have a feeling you're a person of action. You deserve the whole story so you can decide what to do for yourself. Let's jump right in. It's 1974. Richard Nixon is president and America is in turmoil. The country is experiencing a recession and inflation at the same time, what we now call stagflation. Unemployment has skyrocketed. The dollar is in free fall. People wait in long lines for scarce supplies of gasoline, and our nation is held hostage by Arab kings who turn on and off the flow of oil at will. America's economy is very sick and may be dying. It had to change. And thanks to one stroke of genius, it did. I was there. In February 1974, I was asked by Professor Robert W. Tucker of the Johns Hopkins School of Advanced International Studies to join him and four other foreign policy experts for a meeting at the White House. Tucker and I entered the White House complex around 6 p.m. I remember it was a cold night, crisp with clear skies. We were ushered through the security gate on Pennsylvania Avenue near West Executive Drive, closest to the West Wing. Our small group were then escorted to the office of Dr. Helmut Sonnenfeld, Secretary of State Henry Kissinger's deputy on the National Security Council. There, we engaged in strategy discussions. Our focus that night was debating a full-scale military invasion of Saudi Arabia. I'm talking about the violent overthrow of the Saudi government and House of Saud royal family. The idea was we then secure their oil fields, pump enough oil to supply Western and Japanese needs, and price it however we want it. We debated the pros and cons of this plan, including potential supply disruption and international reactions, well into the evening. Now, it may not be covered in the history books, but a military takeover of Saudi Arabia was very much on the table. In fact, the planning was well underway. But the Nixon administration, under Henry Kissinger, decided to try one other approach first. And what they came up with was absolute genius. Have you ever wondered how America became the most potent superpower the world has ever known? More than anything else, it's all because of this one act of genius. A few months after my meeting in June 1974, President Nixon met with King Faisal in Saudi Arabia. A month later, he sent his representatives to offer a new deal. The deal was as straightforward as it was brilliant. Here it is. The Saudis would agree to sell their oil only for U.S. dollars. These dollars for oil were called petrodollars, and the Saudis would then reinvest these petrodollars in U.S. Treasury securities and deposits in U.S. banks. In return, the U.S. would sell advanced weapons and military hardware to the Saudis, and we'd promise U.S. military support to protect Saudi oil fields and the royal family. This would effectively guarantee the House of Saud long-term rule over the country. The final twist was the U.S. banks would then recycle the petrodollars deposited by Saudi Arabia as loans to emerging markets in Latin America, South Asia, and Africa. In turn, those developing countries would purchase U.S., European, and Japanese exports. That would ignite global growth. And of course, to do that, there need to be lots of oil. That meant demand for oil would grow endlessly, as would demand for dollars. It was the ultimate win-win. But the Saudis were famous for dragging their heels in negotiations, and things were getting desperate back home. So the U.S. negotiators used a tactic worthy of godfather Don Corleone himself. They emphasized the unstable geopolitical nature of the Middle East and the fact that Saudi Arabia, with limited military capabilities at the time, could easily be invaded by Israel. And of course, they may also have mentioned Iran's former prime minister, Mohammad Mossadegh, in the 1950s. Mossadegh decided to nationalize Iran's oil industry, taking it back from Western oil companies. Soon after, a U.S.-backed coup overthrew his government. Mossadegh lived out the rest of his life under arrest, and a pro-Western leader replaced him. You can imagine Nixon's negotiators may have shared this charming tale with their Saudi counterparts. The message would be unmistakable. Say yes now because you might like our next offer a lot less. It's no surprise the House of Saudi agreed to that deal. And the 1974 petrodollar accord was born, or as I call it, America's doomsday deal. The Saudis got weapons, safe investments, high oil prices, and increased demand for their oil. The U.S. got cheap debt financing, weapons sales, increased influence in the Middle East, and a dominant global role for the dollar. From the start, the petrodollar accord was a win-win. But it was a win for the Saudis. It was a win for us. Because within a year, every OPEC member got in line. They all agreed to sell their oil exclusively for U.S. dollars. And of course, because every country in the world needs oil, that meant every country in the world now needed dollars. Lots of them. Oil is by far the most traded commodity on Earth. Just look at this chart. 
Nothing else comes close. Ever since 1974, the petrodollar accord has created a never-ending demand for dollars. And that demand has, for most of the past half century, guaranteed the U.S. the upper hand in all world trade. Because every country needs oil. Industry runs on oil. You can't build an economy without it. And thanks to the genius of the petrodollar accord, no dollars equals no oil. Therefore, to get dollars for oil, countries need to sell their goods to America. And they need to maintain good relations with Washington to be sure we don't cut them off. What a deal. Here's another thing. We are the only country on the earth that gets to purchase oil in our own currency. That means when we need oil, we just print more dollars and say, here you go. No other country can do this. They need to provide real goods and services to get dollars. Or they can buy dollars in the foreign exchange market at a premium, but not us. If we need more oil, we just ask the U.S. Treasury to print us a few more billion and hand them over. And don't forget all the oil-producing nations must reinvest their petrodollars by buying up U.S. bonds and securities. That means we also enjoy endless debt financing at low interest rates. This is called petrodollar recycling, and it's one of the most valuable pieces of the agreement. It means the U.S. can operate at an enormous deficit. Because our government debt is constantly being financed by more and more petrodollars, that allows us to spend on our military and economic growth in a way no other country can. The truth is the petrodollar accord essentially guaranteed the United States would become the dominant global power and stay that way. Because of Nixon's brilliant 1974 doomsday deal, no other country can compete with us. The petrodollar deal is the bedrock of our economy. It's our secret superpower. Say what you will about Nixon, and much of it is well earned, but one thing is for sure. The petrodollar doomsday deal was genius. In my opinion, the Petrodollar Accord is the most important agreement since the Treaty of Paris ended the Revolutionary War in 1783. Every president, until Joe Biden, has known that. And I firmly believe they defended it with American lives when necessary. Here's another thing you won't find in any history books. In 2000, Iraq's leader Saddam Hussein, once a staunch ally of the U.S., announced his country would unhitch its oil business from the petrodollar. Instead, he would begin accepting euros for oil, not dollars. By 2002, Saddam had fully converted to a petro-euro, and that was a big threat to the petrodollar accord. If one oil nation broke away, would others follow? Immediately, the U.S. dropped crushing sanctions on Iraq's economy, but we were just getting started. After all, this is 2002. The 9-11 attacks had just happened. Now Saddam Hussein was a monster, no question. But Iraq had nothing to do with 9-11. Most of the hijackers were Saudi. None were Iraqi. Nevertheless, the White House began claiming Iraq was involved in 9-11 and that Saddam's government was stockpiling weapons of mass destruction, those infamous WMDs. You know what happened next. The U.S. invaded Iraq in 2003. We never found any WMDs, but we got rid of Saddam. He spent his last moments hanging from a jailer's noose. But here's something few people know. The U.S. had always planned to invade Iraq. Take a look at a Pentagon document called Foreign Suitors for Iraqi Oil Field Contracts. It details how Iraq's oil fields would be carved up and given to Western oil companies. The document is dated March 5, 2001. That's six months before 9-11 happened, and it's a full two years before the invasion of Iraq. Of course, after the war and Saddam's execution, Iraq's new regime went back to trading their crude oil for dollars. The petrodollar accord was safe again, until that is in the mid-2000s. Libyan dictator Muammar Gaddafi announced a plan to create one universal currency for all of Africa. The new currency would be called the gold dinar. And guess what? President Gaddafi planned to sell his country's oil only for gold dinars and not the petrodollar. That was a problem. So the U.S. gave support to local anti-Gaddafi rebels. On October 20th, 2011, a U.S. Predator drone struck a convoy in which President Gaddafi was traveling. Rebel forces moved in and captured Gaddafi. Gruesome videos showed what happened next. They beat him, rammed a bayonet where the sun doesn't shine, and then shot him dead in the street. When Gaddafi died, so did the gold dinar. The petrodollar was safe again. Since Nixon, every U.S. president has understood the vital importance of the petrodollar doomsday deal to our economy, security, and world standing. In fact, it should come as no surprise that the U.S. maintains a major military presence in much of the Persian Gulf region, including Bahrain, Iraq, Kuwait, Oman, Qatar, Saudi Arabia, United Arab Emirates, Jordan, and Yemen. Our troops and military hardware send a clear message. The doomsday deal cannot be broken. 
The petrodollar accord is sacred and we'll protect it at any cost. Well, I should rephrase that. We used to protect the petrodollar accord because then came President Joe Biden and his cast of clowns. Thanks to Biden's incompetence and the huge mistake he made on February 24th, 2022, the unthinkable has now happened. The doomsday deal is broken. Because of Biden's mistake, the genius agreement that made America into a global superpower is falling apart in front of our eyes. And I predict, based on my 40 plus years of global financial experience, the US dollar will die with it. Bringing in hyperinflation like we've never seen, crushing the value of money in your savings and retirement accounts, tanking our economy and changing our country's global standing forever. Thanks to Biden's weakness and foreign policy failures, our enemies and even our allies are emboldened. The doomsday deal is cracked wide open. This is all happening as I speak. On January 17th, 2023, shots were fired. Saudi Arabia humiliated Biden and thumbed his nose at America by announcing it is considering accepting other currencies for its oil and the floodgates are opening. On March 8th, 2023, Reuters reported another massive blow. India and Russia are now ditching the dollar and trading oil in non-dollar currencies. On March 28th, Brazil and China announced an agreement to conduct all future trade transactions using their own currencies. It gets even worse. Even our so-called allies see the writing on the wall because that same day, French oil giant Total Energies announced it had bought liquefied natural gas from a Chinese oil company using the Chinese currency, the yuan. It's picking up steam. Now other US allies like India, Pakistan, and United Arab Emirates have made deals with Russia or China to buy oil or other commodities in their own currencies. They're all dumping the dollar. Oh, and remember how just two decades ago we invaded Iraq and toppled Saddam Hussein to keep the petrodollar accord in place? With Biden in the White House, they're laughing at us now. Iraq announced this year they're now trading their oil for Chinese yuan. The Americans killed in Iraq lost their lives in vain. Iraq called Biden's bluff, and he's too weak to do anything about it. It gets worse. Saudi Arabia, our old partner in the deal, has now formally applied to join the BRICS group of nations. I'm talking about the economic alliance between Brazil, Russia, India, China, and South Africa. The BRICS nations already represent almost one third of the entire global GDP. In fact, the BRICS economies are bigger than the US, Germany, Japan, the UK, France, Canada, and Italy combined. But if Saudi Arabia joins, our enemies are already salivating at the thought. The Middle East Monitor news site wrote, if Saudi Arabia is accepted and joins the BRICS, it would be hailed as a momentous blow to the dollar and the end of petrodollar recycling, as the kingdom would then be more economically interconnected with the likes of China and India in particular. The decision on Saudi Arabia joining BRICS will happen this year, but it could escalate even more. Because spearheaded by Vladimir Putin, the BRICS countries are now working to create their own currency to defeat the dollar. They're building it right now, and as many as 24 countries have already lined up to say they'll happily accept this BRICS coin when it launches. All of this signals the end of both the doomsday deal and the role of our own dollar in global trade. I predict the results will be catastrophic for the United States. Again, you don't need to take my word for it. Monica Crowley, the former Assistant Secretary for Public Affairs at the U.S. Treasury under President Trump, told Fox News what would happen if Saudi Arabia begins trading oil in other currencies. There would be a complete implosion of the global economic system, certainly the American economic system. And if that were to happen, you'd be looking at sky-high inflation just raging. Weimar Republic kind of inflation. She's referring to 1920s Germany when consumer prices doubled every four days. If you think inflation is bad right now, just wait. But more importantly, Crowley said, we would lose our economic dominance and we would lose our superpower status. There you have it. The end of the doomsday deal is the end of the America you know. Biden's mistake, which I'll fully reveal just a moment from now, has set our decline in fast motion. And there's no way to stop it now. The de-dollarization of the world economy is underway, and I believe it will bring raging inflation, a rapid plunge in the value of the dollar, meaning the worth of your retirement and savings accounts will be suddenly reduced to a fraction of what they are today. Our standard of living will fall. We'll face spiking crime and civil unrest as people struggle to access basic necessities. On a global scale, our nation's ability to invest in defense will be compromised, leaving us vulnerable to a direct attack from our enemies. Don't believe me? It's happened before. From the 1800s all the way through to the 1950s, the British pound sterling was the leading reserve currency. 
That means it was considered the strongest and most stable currency, and other countries stockpiled it as a safe haven for their wealth. During this time, the United Kingdom's economic strength made it the world's first global superpower. At the peak of its empire, the UK represented only 2.5% of the world's total population, yet it controlled over 20% of the Earth's landmass and held dominion over 25% of the global population. Most incredibly, the UK's empire produced 20% of the entire world's income. However, by the Second World War, it was over. The British Empire was in decline, and the pound was losing its reserve status. By the 1950s, it was surpassed by our dollar as the new global reserve currency. But there's a lesson we should pay close attention to. Losing reserve status was catastrophic for the United Kingdom. Listen to this for how bad it could get. From 1750 to 1935, during its 185-year run as the world's top superpower, prices in the UK and its territories increased on average about 1% per year. But for the 70-year period between 1935 and 2005, as the pound lost its reserve currency status and their economy tanked right with it, inflation exploded by 5,000%. That's an average of about 70% every year. By the 1970s, just a few decades after the pound had lost its status, Britain had fallen into chaos. No jobs, labor strikes and riots, people freezing in their homes, crime and violence spiking. And that's not all. Once feared the world over, the UK military was weakened by their struggling economy, leading to something that once would have been unimaginable. A country as fragile as Argentina attacked UK-held territories in 1982. They slaughtered British citizens. The respect, the fear was gone. That's the price of losing superpower status. Could that happen to us? Could China or Russia attack US positions around the world or even here at home? My military intelligence background tells me don't rule it out. That's what the death of the doomsday deal could mean to our nation. But why did it have to happen? It didn't. It was the result of outrageous incompetence by calamity Joe Biden. On February 24th, 2022, Russia invaded Ukraine. Biden's actions on that day and in the months following have set in motion America's downfall because the sanctions he levied against Russia have done almost no harm to Putin. But they backfired terribly against us. Here's what I mean. Starting February 24, 2022, the Biden administration launched an unprecedented set of financial sanctions on Russia. They were intended to wreck the Russian economy and force Russia to withdraw from Ukraine. The most extreme war hawks in the Biden administration even suggested that the sanctions would be the end of Putin for good. But Biden, who, and I don't say this lightly, I believe is significantly mentally compromised and very possibly senile, made one huge mistake. You see, in addition to sanctioning oligarchs, banning U.S. investment in Russia, kicking Russia out of the SWIFT international messaging system, and freezing and stealing assets, Biden's sanctions went so far as to freeze and hold the U.S. dollar reserves of the Central Bank of Russia. I wrote at the time that not only would this move fail to hurt Russia, but it would also boomerang and do extreme damage to the United States. I'm truly sad to say I was right. Biden made a massive error. Because when other countries saw the U.S. grab the assets of a major central bank, they asked themselves the obvious question. What if the U.S. doesn't like my politics or actions in international affairs? Will Biden then seize my central bank assets too? Many countries, including China, India, and Brazil, decided the answer might be yes. They immediately started selling off their holdings of U.S. Treasury debt and began to pay for imports in their own currencies. Biden's mistake has accelerated the death of the doomsday deal. It set it into high gear. Make no mistake, the 1974 petrodollar accord is mortally wounded. But Biden's blunder created an even bigger threat. The status of the dollar as the world's global reserve currency is now in question, like what happened to the United Kingdom in 1935. According to one analysis in 2001, just about 20 years ago, of all the currency held by countries in reserve, their reserve currencies, a full 73% of it was in U.S. dollars. By the end of last year, that had plummeted to just 47%, and it's dropping fast. As Stephen Jen, who runs Money Horizon SLJ Capital, a London-based global investment manager, said, the dollar suffered a stunning collapse in 2022 in its market share as a reserve currency, presumably due to its muscular use of sanctions. In 2022, the dollar lost reserve currency market share at a pace 10 times as rapidly. And why is the dollar dropping market share so quickly? 
You guessed it, Biden's bonehead of blunder. This erosion in the dollar's reserve currency status has accelerated precipitously since the start of the war in Ukraine, said Jen. Exceptional actions taken by the U.S. and its allies against Russia have startled large reserve holding countries. It seems reasonable to speculate that the main driver of the collapse in the dollar's reserve currency status in 2022 may have reflected a panicked reaction to property rights being jeopardized. Or as the Middle East monitor crowed, the U.S. seems to have scored a devastating self-goal against this currency when it cut Russia off from the SWIFT payment system and froze over $350 billion of its gold and foreign exchange reserves. That act alone massively reduced trust in the dollar-based monetary system amongst many countries, causing them to further question the viability and risk of holding their reserves in the mighty dollar. There you have it. Biden's sanctions failed to hurt Putin, but they will be devastating for you and me and all good Americans. By weaponizing the dollar, Biden and his inept cronies have caused trading partners to flee the dollar. This never should have happened. It seems the greatest threat to the dollar and our economy are not the actions of China, Russia, or others. The greatest threat to our economy and global security comes from the incompetence of Joe Biden, Treasury Secretary Janet Yellen, and her equally incompetent subordinates at the U.S. Treasury. The worst has already happened. The doomsday deal, the sacred petrodollar accord, is done. Within the next 24 months, I predict a flood of countries will begin using their own currencies to buy oil. I'm afraid this can't be stopped. Biden's weakness and incompetence has doomed America. Our economy will flounder. The dollar will sink like a pebble in a pond. We'll suffer crippling inflation unlike anything in American history. And your personal accounts will plummet in value. Unless you do this one thing right now. You see, I do have good news today. You can still protect yourself, your family, and your wealth, just like I have. But there's one thing. You must act now. There's almost no time left. The doomsday deal is dying. The petrodollar is almost gone. It won't be long now before the U.S. dollar loses its status. This will be devastating for most Americans. Most Americans, but not all. Not you. I refuse to stand back and let the fascists take control. Not without a fight. That's why I've created something you won't find anywhere else on Earth. A true game plan for America after the doomsday deal for protecting your savings, for exploiting Biden's blunder, just like the world's elite will, and emerging stronger, safer, and potentially wealthier than before. It's called the Doomsday Survival Protocol, and it's a financial success plan for the coming storm. The Doomsday Survival Protocol allows you to survive a new world where the dollar has lost much of its power and standing. And even better than that, it was designed to help you profit from the turmoil it will bring. My background inside the U.S. intelligence community, investment banks, and global currency markets has shown me how smart investors could profit from the failure of the doomsday deal. That's exactly what the doomsday survival protocol was designed to do. By watching this full presentation, I know you're a lot smarter than the average Joe, and certainly the one who's currently our president. You see that America will be transformed by Biden's mistake. Unless you know exactly what to do, you and your family could soon lose significant wealth. That's why today I'm going to share my full doomsday survival protocol with you. I feel it's my responsibility as a patriot and sovereign citizen. I've written up the full step-by-step -step game plan in a new report called The Doomsday Survival Protocol, Securing Your Sovereign Wealth and Freedom. In a moment, I'm going to show you how to claim your own copy of the Doomsday Survival Protocol report. Inside, you'll see step-by-step -step details on how to escape the coming dollar crisis, including how to, number one, Create an off-the-grid fortune. Secure $1.1 million in wealth inside a hollow soda can safe. Number two, save your God-given freedoms. Have liquidity and spendable wealth without the dollar. Number three, grow your personal wealth. You'll get specific investment upside as events unfold. And four, ensure you maintain your wealth regardless of external conditions. And that's just the start of what you'll get. The bottom line is this, having specific assets secured and off the grid now will mean you're able to offset the fluctuations in the dollar and our economy. That's why you need my doomsday protocol. Not only that, but everything you'll see is completely legal. It might infuriate Biden, Yellen, and their cronies, but there's nothing they can do about these financial survival loopholes. Your wealth and your freedom will be secure, and you'll be the only one on your block who knows these secrets. Feel free to share them with your loved ones. They'll be so thankful, and you can relish saving them from Biden's blunder. All you have to do is say yes, Jim, to this special opportunity today. 
and I'll send you your own personal copy of my new report, The Doomsday Survival Protocol, free. That's right. I'm not asking you to pay one red penny for my new strategy for securing and even growing your personal wealth. I've set aside one free copy for you, and I'll explain exactly how to claim it in a moment. But I want to give you one more thing first. Anyone who has followed my career knows that I trust the strength of gold. Gold is the most stable, long-term form of money the world has ever known. Throughout human history, there have been thousands of fiat currencies, or paper money. As far as I can tell, 100% of fiat currencies have eventually lost all value. But gold? Gold has been accepted as currency across the globe for more than 5,000 years. Gold has always increased in value over time. And of course, it can't be tracked. In uncertain times, I'd rather put my faith in 5,000 years of human history. Did you know central banks throughout the world last year bought the most gold on record since 1950? I'm talking about a whopping 1,252 tons of gold worth some $70 billion. Why are they buying up gold? Because they know a change is coming. They see how fragile our international monetary system is, and they know gold is an asset that will always have value. In fact, I now predict gold could hit $11,000 per ounce. That's why I want to send you another free report today. It's called The Perfect Physical Gold Portfolio. Everything you need to know about buying the right kind of physical gold. It's 11 pages long, answering everything you need to know, including, is gold safe to invest in? How much should I invest in precious metals? What kind of precious metals should I buy and in what quantities? What kinds of metals should I avoid? Where are the best places to buy gold and other precious metals? And what are the best and safest ways to store them to avoid theft or government confiscation? Because of the imminent decline of the dollar and to help you invest in gold before prices potentially skyrocket and it's too late, I've created a way for you to claim a free copy of this report today. So you can have all the information you need to invest in precious metals the right way. That's still not all I have for you. You see, I've learned of another little appreciated asset that's a liquid form of wealth. It can't be tracked or traced. It's completely legal and easy to find if you know where to look. Over time, its value has steadily grown, but very few people know anything about its investment potential. You're about to be one of the few. I believe you must include this secret asset in any off-the-grid portfolio. I'll tell you exactly what it is and how to get in. America's secret currency. Get in on the ultimate off-the-grid asset. If you want to keep your wealth hidden away from the government's prying eyes, you'll want to read this report first. But that's not all I want to send you. I just finished writing one more free report for you, and this one could be the most valuable of all. How would you like to profit from Biden's mistake to beat them all at their own game? The way I see it, the death of the doomsday deal is going to be a national crisis, but with turmoil comes opportunity. Why not potentially grow your current wealth by investing in the triumphant return of American energy? You see, there's one American industry that I believe is going to win big from Biden's mistake without the ability to just print more dollars to buy oil. Biden will be forced to turn back to American energy. In fact, he's already doing it. Biden is now opening up federal oil and gas fields. They're trying to keep it quiet, but I have the proof right here. According to official records, the Department of the Interior approved 3,557 new permits for oil and gas drilling on public lands in Biden's first year. That was about 1,000 more permits than during the first year of the Trump administration. Bet you haven't heard about that, right? I believe the death of the doomsday deal is going to mean big things for the American energy industry. That's why your report number four, the return of American energy, is so important. Inside, you'll see step-by-step -step details on little-known energy opportunities identified using my complexity theory system that few experts currently see coming. Here's just one example of what you'll find inside. Have you ever heard of a small modular reactor or SMR? SMRs are nuclear reactors that are smaller and much safer than conventional reactors. They provide reliable, scalable power day in, day out. And in the next few years, I think they're going to change how much of the world, including the US, gets its energy. Nuclear reactors are normally huge, complex, expensive utilities, but SMRs are simplified. They're almost completely built inside a factory. You just ship them wherever you need them. SMRs are also much safer than old-style nuclear reactors. In an accident, these things are designed to automatically shut down. The chance of radiation being released is basically non-existent. And SMRs emit hardly any carbon or greenhouse gases, so even the greeniacs can't complain. They're going to be a game changer, and here's the best part. 
Most SMRs are being developed through private investment. That means you can still get in on them before they explode in value, but you have to know where to invest. About 70 companies are currently working on their own SMR. Most won't come to anything, but one is poised to win big from SMR technology. And if you get in on this company, it could feel like getting in on the ground floor at Apple or Tesla. But as of today, no one really knows a whole lot about them. That's why I put down everything you need to know about getting in on the best SMR stock in your personal copy of The Return of American Energy. This report is your private roadmap to winning during the coming energy boom. Inside this report, which I'll send you today at my own cost, you can claim your personal copy in just a moment, I show you how SMRs will revolutionize energy production across the United States and the world. Which of the four different SMR technologies under development went out and why? And how there is one company currently tied to developing SMRs I believe is both undervalued and now poised for major gains. If you're interested in getting in, I show you exactly how to invest in this company, including when to buy in and how you could walk away with big profits. I will also cover the risks, since after all, no investment is guaranteed. And that's just the start of what you'll get. Traditional energy sources like fossil fuels aren't going anywhere. And as overseas oil gets too expensive, America will soon need to turn back to them. Call it the revenge of the fossil fuels, if you like, because right now, I'm watching three companies with innovative solutions in oil and gas, refining and pipelines, Appalachian Coal, and the Marcellus Gas Shell region that I believe will gain big over the next few years. I believe you'll have the chance to ride their wins if you follow exactly what I show you in report number four, the return of American energy. Here's what I mean. On page eight, I show you a US oil and gas driller with massive acreage in America's crown jewel oil field that I think is in a great position to explode with growth as our nation returns to American energy. You'll get everything you need to know on page eight of your new report. But that's not all. I'm also watching a company that supplies specialized components for oil and gas drilling, and I think they're poised for huge growth. Will you be with them? On page nine of The Return of American Energy, I'll show you everything you need to know. Then I'll also show you how we're in a golden age of refiner profit margins. And I'm looking at one refiner positioned for huge gains, because even if US prices stabilize, this refiner can export diesel to Asia, Europe, wherever it's needed. And I show you every detail you need to get in on page 12 of your new report, the return of American energy. I show you exactly why I believe the coming return of American energy means each of these companies is poised for a massive increase in value and how you can get in on them right now before they go up. But that's still not everything you'll get. There's so much more I have for you. Friend, I believe the return of American energy report is your roadmap to seeing your personal wealth grow even while much of America faces difficult financial times. The fact is most people won't heed this warning They'll sit back and trust our government to bail them out. You know as well as I do, that won't happen. But you don't have to lose. With your private copy of The Return of American Energy in hand, you can win, and win big. I want to send you a personal copy today. I'm serious. You'll get the full benefit of my 40 years inside the CIA, Pentagon, Department of Defense, and White House, helping lead a major investment bank, and using the complexity theory system to help me determine the stocks and other assets that are doomed to fail, and those that are more likely poised to explode with growth. You'll have a chance to get in on them all and see your own wealth grow. Just say yes to this opportunity today, and you won't pay anything for your report. I'll be candid with you. I came from humble roots, but I've made myself a wealthy man, and I want to do the same for good Americans like you. Claim your personal copy of the Return of American Energy report today. Then just follow the step-by-step -step game plan I've written for you, and sit back Relax and enjoy the protection and upside this offers because you'll be informed, protected, and possibly wealthier than you ever imagined. Look, America is still a free country. All of this is your choice. You can get your report today and decide to do nothing at all or invest just a little to potentially pad your savings. Or you can invest more, recognizing the unique opportunity this situation holds, learning about the companies I believe are in a unique position to exploit the coming boom, following the plays I outlined for you, and potentially winning big. Friend, you could be one of the few who wins during this coming storm. It might infuriate Biden, but there's nothing he can do about you profiting from his mistakes. And you'll be the only one on your block who knows these secrets. All you need to do is say yes, Jim, to this special opportunity today, and I'll send you your own personal copy of my new report, 
The Return of American Energy. That's right, I've already set aside one copy for you, and I'll explain exactly how to claim it in a moment. When it hits your inbox, make sure you open your Return of American Energy report right away to be sure you don't miss out. When you get all four free reports, one, the Doomsday Survival Protocol, two, the Perfect Physical Gold Portfolio, three, America's Secret Currency, and four, the Return of American Energy, you'll be prepared to create a liquid, legal, off-the-grid, $1.1 million portfolio, shield your purchases and activities from government surveillance, invest in the three companies poised to profit from the digital dollar, hold the right amount of the right kind of gold, invest in America's little appreciated, untraceable liquid asset, potentially increase your personal wealth with specific hard asset holdings, and investing in the triumphant return of American energy, protect your family's freedoms, and be in a position of power compared to others who don't have your knowledge. Fact is, you're about to join an elite group of people who know the truth about the new war on our freedoms and how to make it work to your personal advantage. What you've learned today isn't widely known. The media has largely ignored the threat, or they simply don't understand the danger. The American public is being led to the slaughter. But there are some who are prepared. There are a few Americans whose freedoms are secured and who are ready to profit from the turmoil. You see, everything you've seen today was first shared with a small private circle of citizens. Every month, I take what I've learned from my contacts and connections in the intelligence and global finance communities, and I write it all up in private issues of a newsletter I call Strategic Intelligence. In Strategic Intelligence, I warn my readers of the coming threats to our economy and our freedoms. In 2008, I predicted the U.S. housing collapse. No one believed me at the time. Three weeks later, Lehman Brothers went belly up and markets crashed, devastating the retirement savings of millions of Americans. Then in 2016, the experts were shocked when I predicted Brexit. The media said it would never happen until I was proven right. Then, despite 99% of polls showing the opposite, I stood outside Trump Tower the night before the 2016 election and declared Donald Trump would be our next president. Then in late 2021, several months before the first shots were fired in Ukraine, I alerted my readers this war was an almost certainty. It gets bigger. I'm watching a global situation unfold right now that can make all of these events seem minor. There's a coming crisis that would bring devastating bank defaults across the world, including here in the United States. There's more. I'm also hearing early whispers of another military conflict brewing, and this time it's much closer to home. What will this do to financial markets, your retirement savings, and American global security? Because of my contacts and experience, I have access to certain information that even our own government doesn't know and I share every detail with my private circle of strategic intelligence readers. But even better than that, I show them how to profit from these events. You see, I've developed a revolutionary way of looking at the financial system and stock markets. It's called complexity theory. It's unlike anything you've seen before. I estimate less than 10 people in the world know how to apply it. Complexity theory gives me insight on exactly how the dollar's fall could play out, what stocks might tank, and what assets could rocket up in price. It allows me to warn my strategic intelligence readers well in advance of the coming collapse. I use my expertise to help show them how to build safe investment positions in stocks, bonds, cash, art, land, precious metals, and other hard assets. Today, I want to extend a personal invitation to you. I'd like you to join my private inner circle of strategic intelligence readers. If you say yes, you'll be privy to the similar secrets, predictions, and advice I usually reserve only for the U.S. intelligence community and my private high net worth clients. My goal with strategic intelligence is to help you profit while others flounder. Every month, I'll write directly to you, keeping you informed and armed on how the dollar's collapse and replacement is unfolding. I'll warn you about my potential triggers that may set off an economic or social crisis. And I'll use complexity theory to give you specific investment recommendations and wealth protection strategies intended to help you increase your wealth, even during the meltdown. My strategic intelligence issues are unlike any other resource on the planet. Only you will be prepared to survive and even thrive in the coming storm. Only you will benefit from insights and advice from 40 years operating at the highest levels of government and financial institutions. Each dossier is easy to read and follow, but I don't pull any punches. Strategic intelligence is for Americans who appreciate the uncensored truth and who want to win while weaker thinkers struggle. I believe you're my kind of person. I believe you're poised to profit during the turmoil to come. 
And I believe you'll never sit back and let the fascists win. So let's do this. Say yes to my invitation. Join my private circle of monthly strategic intelligence readers. I request a small fee to join. It helps cover my time and the expense of mailing each monthly dossier. It's normally $99 a year, which is a bargain for the level of insight you'll gain and the potential profits you'll enjoy. After all, my speaking fee at events is typically $25,000, and my clients don't blink an eye. They know their returns will far outpace that investment. But $99 is not what I'm going to ask you to pay today. The situation is urgent. Biden and the Dems have failed every good American, and your life savings are now at risk. And I don't want there to be any reason you don't have access to the information you and your family need now. So effective immediately, I'm cutting the regular price in half. Today, I'd like to offer you a full year, 12 issue subscription to my strategic intelligence newsletter for just $49. That's a 50% discount. It means for the equivalent of just a few bucks a month, you'll get private insight into threats against our democracy and freedom and wealth building opportunities most people will never hear about. Plus, I guarantee today's special price will never increase as long as you're a subscriber. Even if I'm forced to raise the price in future, your discounted price is locked in forever. But it gets better, because when you subscribe today, I'll immediately send your four free bonus gifts. Free report number one, the Doomsday Survival Protocol, securing your sovereign wealth and freedom. Inside this new report, you'll get step-by-step -step details on how to survive and prosper as the Doomsday deal dies. Specifically, one, create an off-the-grid fortune, secure $1.1 million in wealth inside a soda can safe. Two, save your freedoms, have liquidity and spendable wealth without the dollar. Three, grow your personal wealth. You'll get possible investment upside as events unfold. Four, ensure you maintain your wealth, regardless of external conditions. Building your own off-the-grid portfolio now will protect you from the coming crisis. The death of the doomsday deal is now underway and is picking up steam. Before it's too late, protect yourself and your retirement savings. You'll find everything you need in your free report. Note, please share it with your most trusted friends and loved ones. And you'll also immediately get your free report number two, the perfect physical gold portfolio. Everything you need to know about buying the right kind of physical gold. 5,000 years of history proves that gold outlasts every other currency. But I believe the failure of the doomsday deal could cause the price of gold to skyrocket, possibly to $11,000 an ounce or higher. In your second free report, you'll find everything you need to know about investing in gold before the price blasts through the ceiling, including, is gold safe to invest in? How much should I invest in precious metals? And what metals should I buy? And what should I avoid? Where are the best places to buy gold and other precious metals? What are the safest ways to store gold to avoid theft or government confiscation? And much more. Plus, I'll also send you free report number three, America's secret currency. Get in on the ultimate off-the-grid asset. Your new report exposes a little appreciated asset that can't be tracked or traced and has increased in value over time. This secret asset should be part of any off-the-grid portfolio. And in America's Secret Currency, I show you everything you need to know. Finally, you'll get free report number four, the return of American energy. With specific investment picks in small nuclear reactors, oil and gas, and other little known opportunities, my research tells me it could soon explode with growth. Want in on all of them now? Free report number four, the return of American energy, shows you how you could profit from America's reinvestment in our own enormous oil and gas resources. All four reports are my gifts to you for simply giving my strategic intelligence profit building dossiers a try. And make no mistake, these four reports are truly a gift. They're always yours to keep, even if you end up canceling for a full refund. Let me explain. In a moment, you'll have the opportunity to join my private inner circle of strategic intelligence readers. When you do, I'll send you all four free reports immediately. In fact, you should have them within minutes of subscribing today. Then I'll also start sending off your exclusive monthly strategic intelligence dossiers the minute I write them. When they arrive in your mailbox, I encourage you to read them right away because some of the best investment opportunities are time sensitive. But make sure the value far exceeds the small subscription fee. Make sure you're enjoying real profits on the little known investment opportunities I recommend to my private subscribers. Make sure the markets in America are rocked by the threats I warn you about in advance every month. And make sure you feel smarter, more secure, and more powerful 
than you did before you subscribed. Take your time. In fact, I want you to take up to a full six months of reading your strategic intelligence dossiers. But if during those six months, you feel that strategic intelligence isn't worth at least 10 times what you paid, I want you to cancel for a full and complete refund. And you keep your four free reports no matter what. Let me repeat that. When you subscribe today, you'll immediately receive your four free reports. Number one, the Doomsday Survival Protocol, securing your sovereign wealth and freedom. And number two, the perfect physical gold portfolio, everything you need to know about buying the right kind of physical gold. Number three, America's secret currency, get in on the ultimate off the grid asset. And number four, the return of American energy, profit from the green lie. And you'll also get my private monthly newsletter, Strategic Intelligence, where you'll find my insights using complexity theory on exactly how the dollar's replacement could play out, what stocks might fall, what assets could rocket up in price, and how to build investment positions in stocks, bonds, cash, art, land, precious metals, and other hard assets, and so much more. Of course, if at any time during the first six months you feel strategic intelligence is not worth many times what you paid, just request a full refund, and I'll be happy to oblige. Plus, you'll keep all your issues and both free gifts, even if you refund. No questions asked, no fine print. Just honest, honorable business, the way things used to be done in our country. It doesn't get any fairer than that, does it? I'm taking the risk because it's that important you prepare now for the death of the doomsday deal and America's sad decline. And speaking of risk, that brings me to one more gift I have for you today. I predict things are about to get even uglier in our country. The coming economic crisis will bring unrest in a way we haven't seen in more than 50 years or maybe ever. When that happens, protecting your money won't be enough. You may need to save your family and property too. That's why I reached out to a colleague and friend, Jason Hansen. Jason is a former CIA operative. He won the CIA Exceptional Performance Award not once but twice. That's about all I'm allowed to say about his past experience, if you catch my meaning. These days, Jason teaches no-holds-barred defense techniques to celebrities, top business executives, and other high-profile targets. He's a mild-mannered, unassuming guy. You'd like him. But when the stuff hits the fan, Jason is positively lethal. If you're ever in a crisis, you want someone like him on your side. That's why I asked Jason if he could develop a personal survival guide for the storm that's brewing, and what he delivered exceeded all my expectations. Jason created a full survival guide called How to Make Your Home Your Personal Fortress. He held nothing back. In this uncensored guide, you'll discover pro-defense techniques like how to implement the CIA's four concentric rings of defense to make your home hell on earth for any intruder, how and why to safely hide a firearm on every level of your house, the simple tool that turns your front door into an impenetrable barrier. Then, do you have this very common door lock? If so, change it immediately. You'll see why in your new report. It's important. Don't believe you can afford your own panic room? Think again. He shows you how to build and equip a devastating defense HQ inside your home for just a few hundred bucks. Jason also included the six steps to survive a societal level event that lasts weeks or months. He even shows you a secret for sourcing top quality survival food for much less than you're paying now. One of my personal favorite chapters is when Jason reveals covert spy secrets for moving undetected at night. With these secrets, you will confidently walk inner city streets or any other unfamiliar environment. Finally, Jason shares the most important information of all, how to defend your family and property against multiple intruders. This section gets intense, but there's nothing pretty about facing a group of thugs who want to do your family harm. Once someone has entered your home, they've abandoned any expectation of mercy. And with the firefighting techniques Jason offers you here, they'll regret ever crossing your property line immediately. These are still just a few of the spy level secrets in how to make your home your personal fortress. Under Jason's guidance, you and your loved ones will never be victims. And that's why I'm including the how to make your home your personal fortress report free when you subscribe today. Again, when you subscribe to Strategic Intelligence, you'll get 12 months, 12 issues, of my private strategic intelligence dossiers, plus free report number one, the Doomsday Survival Protocol, securing your sovereign wealth and freedom. Free report number two, the perfect physical gold portfolio, everything you need to know about buying the right kind of physical gold. Free report number three, 
America's secret currency, get in on the ultimate off-the-grid asset. Free report number four, the return of American energy, profit from the green lie. Bonus free report number five, how to make your home your personal fortress by former CIA officer Jason Hansen. Each of your five free reports will be waiting in your inbox just minutes from now, and you never take any risk. You can ask for a full no questions asked refund at any time during the first six months, and you keep all your strategic intelligence dossiers and all five of your bonus reports, no matter what. But there's one final thing, you must act now. If you know anything about Zuckerberg, Google, and big tech, you know what I've told you today is exactly the kind of thing they'd love to shut down. This message could disappear at any time, and this special half-price offer can't last. So please accept my personal invitation now. Are you ready? Ready to protect your hard-earned money from Biden's blunder? Ready to not just survive the coming storm, but potentially grow your personal wealth? Ready to increase your power and prestige, holding knowledge others don't have? Ready to protect your home and family, no matter what events unfold in America? That's what you'll get today in your strategic intelligence dossiers and five free reports. Okay, it's time. Time for you to decide how the coming crisis will play out for you. Will you become a victim of Biden's mistake? Or are you a person of action? Will you choose to win while others lose by increasing your personal wealth, freedom, and power? Right now, there's a button under this presentation. It says, next step. Go ahead and press that button now. When you do, you'll be taken to a secure encrypted reservation page. There, you can tell me exactly where to send your five free reports. Remember, you take no risk at all. You can cancel for a full refund any time in the first six months, and you keep all your strategic intelligence issues and all five free reports, no matter what. Press the button below now, and I'll meet you on the other side. Thank you for spending this time with me today. For Strategic Intelligence, I'm Jim Rickards. Press the button below to claim your five free reports.